Hey guys, so in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to download aesthetic intro templates and how to add text onto intro templates. I really hope that this video helps you guys out and let's get started. So I'm gonna start off by showing you guys two ways on how you can download your aesthetic intro templates. So for the first way, all you need to do is start a screen recording. If you guys don't have screen recording in your control center, all you need to do is go into settings, click on control center, and then click on the plus right next to screen recording. Click on the video with the template that you like, choose the best quality available, and then let the template play. You can also copy the video link, go to a YouTube to MP3 website, paste the video link in the search bar, scroll down, click on video, and download the MP4 file. Now I'm going to be showing you how to add text to your intro templates using either iMovie on your iPhone or your MacBook computer. Before I add the text, I just like to add the video to the project, adjust the size of the video, and rotate the video to fit the screen, and cut the clip using the split tool right where the template begins and right where the template ends. To get my my text, I like to go onto the app Bonto, press the camera icon, and then press plain images and choose a plain green image. And I would recommend using the size 16 colon 9. Press use and add your text to the image. And you could also center the text and then customize it to however style you like it. Back on iMovie, you're going to click the plus on the left side of the screen, click on the image that we just created, and click on the dot 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 icon. Click on green slash blue screen, and then the text will appear. On the computer, it's super similar. Just add the image to the project, go to cutaway, click green slash blue screen, and don't forget to turn off Ken Burns if you don't want your text to zoom in. And that's basically it. If you want to add some fancier text on iMovie, like the typewriter effect, wavy text, and so much more, then definitely check out my video on how to add aesthetic text on iMovie. That will definitely help you guys out. And yeah, I really hope this video was helpful to you guys. If you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!